Months after it was impounded by the Department of Land and Natural Resources, the problematic Navitech catamaran is still sitting on a grass lot at the Olawai Small Boat Harbor. Jen Beniza has more on the vessel that residents say is an eyesore. Jen. I personally would like to see it gone. <laughs> yes, right. It doesn't belong in the harbor. It has never belonged in the harbor. Nothing gets done. It just sits there. I guess it's a doorstop for Waikiki. The ailing 85-foot Navitech catamaran, also called Sky, has come to rest across from the Hawaii Prince Hotel at the Alawai Small Boat Harbor. In the last week, the vessel's base was tagged with graffiti, yet another symbol of neglect. The state paid $35,000 to pull it ashore in May after it began to sink. The boat was deemed unseaworthy, and the owner, Miracle LLC, was passed due $16,000 in mooring fees. The state auctioned it in June, but that plan failed. They tried to auction it uh, with a base price of, of uh, $20,000, and apparently nobody bid on it. Because if you look at it, it's going to cost way more than that just to get it out of this harbor. The price tag for removal won't be cheap. And because the Alawai Small Boat Harbor is a recreational harbor, the people who live there are the ones who will ultimately pay for it. The recreational harbors are not supported by tax monies at all. They are supported entirely by the mooring fees that we pay for our boats here. And so the money that went to haul that boat back out of the water came from our mooring fees. Okay, rather than going back into making improvements to the harbor. And that really disturbs me. People tell me they've even seen people rummaging through the boat late at night. At nights, you see flashlights on the boat. I've seen it multiple times. I think perhaps everything has been stolen that can be stolen, short of perhaps any kind of copper wiring that they could pull out of there, has been taken. It's just a shell of a boat. Driving down the value of the boat even further. Moskowitz says he has a sinking feeling the problem won't be resolved anytime soon. I think it will be here for years. I reached out to the Department of Land and Natural Resources. They declined to comment at this time. I'll follow up and let you know what happens. Sam.